And what do you do when you leave your house at that point? I walk out of my garage door, I come down and stop it, turn the corner, and head to Jane Doe's front door. So you walk from your garage door out to the sidewalk, right? Okay. How long does that take? Seconds. You walk down that sidewalk, and you turn back in on the aisle that Jane Doe lives on, right? Yes. How long does it take to walk around that corner? And then from there, you walk to Jane Doe's front door at the very end of the complex, right? How long does that take? Seconds. So to get to your front door, Jane Doe's front door, takes how long that night? Seconds. Do you know what time you arrive at her front door? Yeah. So to get to her front door, you have to cross through an opening in her fence, right? Yeah. You cross over that boundary on the fence line, right? Yeah. You go on to her front patio. And what's the first thing you do? I knock. Where do you knock? Okay. How hard do you knock? You don't remember? No. Do you remember telling the police that you knocked lightly? Can you show us how hard to knock on your front door that night? No. You knock directly on your front door? Yes. Front door's made of wood? Yes. Okay. So you knock directly on that wooden front door? Yes. Is there a window in that front door? Uh, a screen? Just to be clear for the jury here, 
talking about first point of no work. We're talking about this area where I'm pointing to, there's a dotted line, there's front door, there's one there. That's our front door. So when I was at that front door, is this what you were referring to? That was the same thing. Okay. And he said after that, you walked around through her gate, right? Yes. The gate is kind of brown, screwy line here has been marked as gate, correct? Yes. Right. You get to that gate, is it open or closed? It's closed. Yeah. And so you open it, right? Yes. Yeah. You walk through the boundary of that gate, right? Yes. Okay. And then what do you do? Walk on the path. So you walk on the path, and that gate upwards on this diagram to where? Where do you stop? So that, past the corner. You walk past the corner of the house. Where I'm pointing here? Yes. Front X right there. Is that about where you uh, walk to? I, I, I don't know. Anyway, so you walk past the corner, right? Yes. Um, and then you look in her sliding glass door, right? No, I don't look in. I look around the corner. Into the patio area? I look around the corner. So you look around this corner, right? Right. Yeah. Okay. So when you say you look around it, where do you look? Towards the patio. Into the patio area? No, I look in the city. In the city of war? Uh, uh, that's patio. I walk down the patio. Follow the main thing, the light on the inside, and I walk back in. This is a 90 degree corner, right? Yes. Okay. So if you look past that 90 degree corner, right? Yes. Okay. And you don't know whether you were you know, several feet past that corner or where you were in relation to that corner, do you? That's the one I can watch So you look into her patio area? I, I, I looked around the corner. And what did you see? I saw what man they like. Where was that light coming from? From the Sliding glass door. We're flattening out this blue sliding glass door on the patio, right? Yes. Yeah. Okay. And so you know that because you saw the light coming out of that sliding glass door, right? That's what I thought I saw. Okay. Were you expecting Jane Doe to be in her patio area at 3 30 in the morning? Yes. Yeah. Okay. So you went back there to see if you could see anything through this sliding glass door, right? I I know you didn't say that, but is that why you went back there? I was trying to get her attention. Uh -huh. So you were trying to look through this sliding glass door to see if you could see her. Fair enough? I was trying to get her attention. Were you anticipating to see her through this sliding glass door when you went to work out here? I don't think I was anticipating. You don't think or you weren't? I don't believe that. You don't believe or you weren't? What? I'm not asking you for speculation, Mr. Frio. I'm asking you what you were expecting that night. Does that make sense? Yes. Okay. So, you look at your patio and you see the light. You were looking back there to see if you could see if Jane Doe was awake in her kitchen, right?
as you sit here today, you don't know what happened to us. I'm, I'm staying here with the benefit today that I have a perspective. I mean, I love that my statements. Sure, I wouldn't describe it as unresponsive, Your Honor. Your Honor, he's, he's asking me to explain what he's going to do. What he's going to do is that he's allowed to respond. Okay. The objection is to stay uh, referencing he was looking at his statements and that is not responsive to the question. You may re ask the question. Thank you, Your Honor. I'm just asking you what you were trying to do by looking into your cabinet that day. For that night. I guess, that early morning. What was it? I was trying to get her attention. And how were you trying to get her attention? I knocked. Okay. So, you actually went over and knocked on this last door here? I got the number. You just said you were trying to get her attention by knocking on the last door, right? And I, I, I believe that 